Hey, hi friends, welcome back. Um, so in the last video, we did show you how to set up a salt water tank. So broadly, we covered how to mix salt and we, we let it to allow for cycling to happen. In this video, we will be covering what are the next steps and what you need to uh, expect during the course of time. First thing first, we check the water parameter to see if it is good for the fishes to survive. Once we found that it is good for fishes to survive, then we added the fish, right? And after two weeks, we noticed diatom getting formed. Um, it will be rusty, but nothing to worry. It's the natural uh, cycling process and um, you need not get scared of it, right? And that's when it is the right time to put in the cleanup crew. So we added the cleanup crew, right? Wait till the end to see how beautifully the cleanup crew did the job. Let's get into the video. This is the salt water master test kit. This helps us to test the various water parameters such as ammonia, nitrate, nitrite and pH. We just followed the instructions given in the test kit. Um, you may now see the test results that we got. The test results looked good and we added the fishes. After adding fishes, within two weeks, you will see these diatoms. This will look a little dusty, uh, as I said before, and you know, sometimes you will get these black spots, but it's absolutely natural and it is a simple that your tank is going in the right direction. I have got some turbo snails and Nazareth snails. These turbo snails will help to clear the algae and uh, diatom from your glasses and rocks while Nasrius snails will go under the sand and clear the excess food. I also got some keto and starfishes. Keto helps to remove the extra nutrition and starfish helps to clean the sand bed. We acclimated the cleanup crew for a while and then added them one by one into the tank. I kept the cleanup crew in specific places where the diatom or algae was more so that it can start doing the work.
So hope you guys enjoyed the video. This is a basic guide on setting up a fish only tank, right? Now stay tuned. Uh, we have further updates. We have added coral and we have also upgraded our tank to three feet tank, right? So keep watching and we will keep posting the new updates.